I want you to think just for a second about breathing. But don't just think about the fact that you are breathing. Think about all the variables that have to be just so in order to create the air and to make the air breathable. So you need oxygen in the air, but also if the air was just oxygen, you would die. The oxygen has to be mixed with nitrogen and other gases, and the whole concoction has to be at the right pressure and temperature in order to deliver the amounts of O2 that you need. The air that you are breathing is a solution. Also, not to belabor the point, but you are kind of a solution as well, albeit ascension. One. A solution, you'll recall from back when we were doing my dirty laundry, is a mixture in which the particles of a solute are dissolved in the particles of the solvent. So what's the solvent in air? Well, whatever there's more of. So nitrogen is the solvent, and oxygen, carbon dioxide, argon, and a bunch of other gases are dissolved in it. All solutions have the qualities that they do because of the same three properties. Molecular structure, pressure, and temperature. These are the factors that affect a substance's solubility, the amount of solute that will dissolve per volume of solvent. Whether we're talking about the air that we breathe, the water that fish breathe, the bubbles in Coca-Cola, or the toxin in the tissues of the Japanese pufferfish, what usually matters most about a solution is how much solute is in it.